All right, boys, be honest. When you think of a Stompy's Hunter, what do you think is usually in their loadouts? Well, I'll tell you what I normally see. They always have to have a 140 RPM hand cannon, whether that's Fatebringer, Ayas Luna, Palindrome, whatever it is. And then they also have a lightweight shotgun. It always has to be a lightweight, and it's either the Reese Walker or the 7 Seraph CQC 12. Now, I'm gonna keep it real with you guys. I honestly have no idea why people like this shotgun so much. I mean, it looks cool, so that's always a plus. The only other thing I can point out is I think it's the only lightweight that has slide shot. I could be wrong on that though. I mean, I hope it's the only lightweight with slide shot. Otherwise, this video is kind of pointless because that's pretty much the only reason I wanted to take another look at this gun. Now, the exact role I have is rifled barrel, assault mag, slide shot, snapshot, and a range masterwork. In my opinion, this is a 4.5 out of 5 god roll. The one thing I'd change is I would prefer to have full choke over rifled. Rifled is a close second because I am using Aphidians and a dexterity mod, so I don't really need extra handling from something like barrel shroud, so that extra range is always nice. But you know, it is pretty nice to have Barrel Shroud as a backup option in case I'm playing on something like Titan or Hunter and I'm not using the Quick Charge mod. In that case, the extra handling would be really, really helpful. But yeah, that's pretty much everything I wanted to say about the CQC. I'm not sure how it's going to stack up compared to something like a Retro, but I guess we're just going to have to find out. I'm going to be pairing it with an Ayas Luna, Top Tree Dawnblade, Aphidian Aspects, and all of these armor mods right here. Anyways, I will see you guys in the Crucible. Wow, Bungie, I'm making a shotgun video so you give me Widow's Court. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to play this one. I think maybe if I just go over to B, we can get some people on this side of the map. But by C flag, n literally nothing's happening over there. We're going to try to challenge from this backside over here. I will be having a lot of primary gameplay in this video as well because I can't just ape everybody I see with the shot. Well, I, I mean, I guess I could, but it wouldn't be too effective. There is a player in apartments over here that I do want to ape. And look at that, this guy's already dipping. I guess he didn't get out of there fast enough though, because we, ooh, that hip fire was clean though. That was actually a very clean hip fire. I'm liking the feel so far. There's a player on B, we're gonna try to ape this guy. Come on, hit him with a nice one tap. Way, is that in the game, sing, sing. You see, I, I just, I can't even be mad at that because look, he killed me with a seven Seraph CQC, meaning the only weapon that can take me out is the CQC, am I correct? Stop the cap. <laughs> There's a player over here and we're gonna double pump him. Nice, perfect. That's where that uh, assault mag comes in. We're gonna slide this as well. Um, what? What is this guy doing? <laughs> These new light players always have me dying, but you know, um, like, bro, bro. Oh, I was trolling too hard. No, dude, I need to stop trolling that new light and actually start playing the game properly because I didn't expect him to have a whole gang of people right there. Here's the new light. We're just going to three tap him pretty easily. I was pretty sure that last hand cannon shot missed, but you know, if Bungie gave it to me, they gave it to me. I'm going to try to shotgun this hunter player. He is invis. That's not going to, it's not going to do much, bro. With the fusion too, we should the be water able to somebody rocks, in 4K. Water Dude, team. you already have the rocket out before you have heavy, man. That is just not a good idea. Wait, where did the heavy go? I didn't grab it. Oh, that guy didn't grab it either. I'm dumb. We're going to shotgun this guy, hit him with the double pump. And there's another guy. It's actually the bot absorbing the shot for his teammate so he doesn't die. I mean, he's good for something, right? He's a good teammate, bullet sponge, whatever you want to call it. Um, This guy doesn't expect it. <laughs> kind of cheesy with the sword kill. We're going to jump over here, hopefully get that one tap. That was really nice. We're going to Icarus into here. Fortunately, I got the slow dash animation. because What? Whoa. Ooh, what was that? What? Did uh did we both try to eager edge there or something? I am really, really confused as to what happened. We're going to go for the... Oh, one tap on that guy, actually. Sword that guy right there. Perfect. And I'm in a really bad spot, so I kind of have to pop my super. Otherwise, I'm dead here. We're going to hit that guy with the Dawnblade midair. Perfect. That, did that guy just dome me with the... Okay. I mean, thank you for the free kill. Two players in the back over here. That was a really good Dawnblade. There's another player right here. We're going to shotgun him. Uh, One more for the seventh column, right? Woo. Nah, it's definitely not a seventh call. I'm not even close, bro. Customer service. Give me straight to the bitch, bro. Customer service. Customer service. Customer service. I still to this day have never dropped in a dude. You're not going to camp in a corner like that and get me. It's not going to happen. But as I was saying, I've actually never dropped the seventh column. I think it's just like. It's one of those things that's really kind of RNG 
Like, don't get me wrong, it takes skill. You have to take out seven people in a row really fast, but it's also RNG with the spawns and whatnot, and I feel like outside of momentum control, it just doesn't happen very often. Player coming through here. We just absolutely mapped that guy. He was already low. We might be able to get another player through the door. I'm just going to be a little bit careful, bait out my teammates. I'm kidding. I'm obviously not trying to bait him out, but, you know, if it happens, it happens. I'm going to go for a risky play here. We're going to sword skate into the... Oh, yeah, that was nice. That was literally perfect. I'm... Yo, these guys have no idea. These guys are not real players. Oh, maybe that guy is a real player, but dude, what were those guys doing? Also, if it looks like I'm making some really poor decisions in this gameplay, I kind of am because I'm just trying to get as many shotgun kills as possible. Like, okay, that was not meant to happen. I tried to Icarus dash to the right and uh, I kind of messed it up. We still got the kill though, so it's not a big deal. Should be able to get another guy on this spawn. Come on. And just like that, that is game. And there's your Goldie, bro. GG's. Not nearly as many shotgun kills as I would have liked, but for Widow's Court, that was not a bad game at all. Bungie, there is no shot y'all give me- Ooh, that guy's not dead! There is no shot y'all give me Widow's Court again. I mean, granted, I am playing Rumble this time around, but seriously, dude? Yeah, safe to say, Bungie, they, they just don't want to see me- uh, They don't want to see me succeed with the shotgun, bro. It's no secret. But you know, I'm about to do my best. There's another player on this uh, wall over here. We're gonna hit him with a nice double tap. So far, we have three shotgun slash melee kills, which is really, really good because, you know, the more the better. I don't want to use my eyes looted too much. This is kind of a... Yeah, I didn't think we'd get that, man. That was a good nade from him. The thing is, you gotta ape early on. That way, later in the game, people don't expect you to use the primary, you know? that Then that's when you get into primary damage, and then... I don't know what just happened. Just uh, don't ask. We're gonna challenge this Warlock player up here. I literally know he's... Yeah, we're he actually gonna wait for him. Oh, <laughs> what is this guy doing? Okay, we're actually gonna challenge this guy right here. It's a Hunter player. He does have a fusion. This is not good. Warlock player, and he's double tapped. I don't know what he was doing that, uh, that first time. And then that Hunter player, I was kind of trolling him as well. And then I saw he had a fusion rifle, and I was like, shit, that was not is that a rocket? Ooh, okay, he's still dead, dude. Uh, I'm really happy that wasn't a G-Horn. I honestly reacted really late against that rocket launcher, but I didn't know it was a rocket until like the last second, so. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the you know, ooh, why? I didn't know. I was not paying attention. So good to know there is a sniper player in the lobby. Is that the sniper? I don't know if that was a sniper. I don't even remember what the guy's name was, which is really unfortunate because you should always be paying uh, attention and rumble. <laughs> yeah, uh, don't, don't do what that guy just did. He was not paying any attention. Um, bro, that, that got nerfed. That, that got nerfed. <laughs> that got nerfed a while ago, dude. You can't. You can't just shatter dive people anymore. Bungie actually took that, uh, they took skill dive out of the game. Well, they didn't take it out of the game, but it got nerfed really, really hard. And it basically never one shots anymore. There's a Warlock player right here. We're gonna hit him with a shotgun and then clean up with the primary, literally perfect. We're just gonna wait for this guy in apartments. And that is a clean one tap while he was dodging. He's probably pissed about that. We have a nice little head glitch on that guy. I'm not too sure who had the head glitch right there. Was it me or him? Because I mean, he was like using it, but it also helped me out because I don't think he knew. Hey, who knows? We're going to challenge this player right here. He doesn't even know we're there. And is that guy sniping again? Okay, thankfully he's not because, dude, when he sniped me that first time, that shit just threw me completely off guard. I was not expecting it. What is up, guys? Um, yeah, bro. <laughs> what was that guy doing? Okay, we're going to wait for this guy. I'm actually going to pop Heat Rises, dodge into this wall, and then we're just going to keep waiting for this guy. I could just pop my super and end this game, but we're going to have some fun. This guy, <laughs> this guy's been crouching with his... Oh, he just got domed. Oh my god, I was going to troll that guy, but the dude with the uh, the Praetis Revenge just bopped him. We're going to troll around a little bit because why not? This guy, we're just going to double pump him because that's just the best idea. Now, for this last kill, we can do something kind of weird. I'm going to pop Heat Rises, and we're just going to hit this guy with like a bunch of spin moves, and then just see if we... Oh, that was... Yeah, he knew about it. I really wanted to kill the guy who crouches with his fusion for last, but I can't seem to find that dude anywhere. Like, did he leave the game or something? Player right here. We're actually just going to take out the DMT guy because he's using a DMT. Oh, this was him! No, dude! <laughs> what is this guy, bro? <laughs> So that is pretty much going to be all of the gameplay that I have for today's video. After using the CQC, this thing kind of slaps. I'm not going to lie. I can see why every Stompy Hunter hypes this thing up. Now, do I think it's as good as a slug? Absolutely not. I mean, it's a pellet shotgun. It's not going to be as good as a slug. Slugs are just, they're kind of nutty right now. But in terms of pellet shotguns, this might even be the best one in the game. 
But as always, if you guys did enjoy this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you left a like and a comment letting me know what you thought. And if you're new around here, it never hurts to hit that subscribe button. Anyways, it's been Gravely. Peace.